Welcome back to Aisha Platform. So on this video today, I am going to be showing you all on how to create label on Jira. So it is very simple and very easy to create lab label. Or oh, let me just show you this. So you, I'm actually opening up a ticket. This ticket is IS6, um, the ticket number from Jira. So I'm opening up the ticket so I can get a full view on the ticket. So then I go on that labels. And right here, according to this label, currently it said none. So I plan to later on show you all how I track dependency on Jira. And so I'm going to be labeling some of those tickets as dependency. So right now we do not have label. When I do click on it, it's showing me my previous label that I've used in the past. But I want to create a new label. And to create a new label, you basically just click on the label bar. And when you do click on it, and I want to call this new label as dependency. You just start typing the name of the label you want to call, the particular item you want to label. And in this case, uh, I'm going to label this as dependency. dependency. So you see at the bottom here, it's asking me, is this going to be new label? And then I'll click on it and I will say, yes, that's going to be a new label. And I'll click on it. And guess what? Then I click out and that's it. So that's how you create label. And now that label now is there as dependency. And if I want to use this new label now for other tasks that I have in my backlog, I just go back to the backlog view and I go to the tasks or the book tickets or story that I want to label. Let's say I want to label, label this book tickets as dependency. And I'm click on the box tickets. And even though you don't even have to fully open it, open the whole box ticket. So now I go under the label area and I put my arrow in there and I just click on this newly created dependency, um, dependency label. So I just click on that and I click out and that's it. So that's now label dependency. And let's say I want to create another label called um bug um. But issue one. So I just click on the ticket itself and I just come on the label and I type. You can also create a new label right from outside. I just put your issue one. This is just something I created. It's not so it's asking me again, okay, because you notice that I do not have this any other label showing up. So then Jira is asking me, is this going to be a new label? And I'll say yes and I'll click on it. And it automatically creates it. And that's it. And that's how you create label on Jira. It's very, very simple and easy. And you can create as multiple labels as you can or, or components. Um, so that's it. If you find my content valuable, please like and subscribe to Aisha Scrum. I appreciate you all and see you again in my next video.